Now we have to thank Mr. Pilcher, editor of Zoo, the popular nature journal, for introducing us to some of his friends in the aquarium at the London Zoo. To such a happy family, for instance, as these bass and skate. And of course, when the dogfish snapped, we snapped him. While green turtles provide the soup at city banquets, the tortoise shell of commerce is produced only by the hawk's bill, of which this is a fine specimen. The mud skipper has goggle eyes on stalks, and they move independently. If exposed to sunshine for any length of time, it moistens its eyes by drawing them deep into the sockets. The fighting fish of Siam. The males, at any rate, have to be kept apart, or there's a pretty kettle of fish. They can't bear the sight of each other, and the Siamese stake money on the fights. The queer little seahorse can be safely backed as the aquarium favorite. He floats upright in the water, steering his way with his breast fins and looking like the knight in a set of chessmen. And like the knight, his body is encased in armor, bony plates, which when varnished make the most dinky hat ornaments. It's claimed that seahorses can talk to each other by snapping their jaws, just as humans talk about their horses after the race. 